What's up, everybody? I'm back again today with another video. Today, we're going to be doing something a little different. Today, we're going to be taking a look at the Zach Reed iceberg. You guys may have seen this image floating around the internet. It's become pretty popular in recent days, but today we're going to take a deep dive and check out every tier, break it down. And if you guys are unaware what an iceberg video is, basically, it's stuff that relates to a certain thing. It's kind of like a rabbit hole in a way. And all the common Zach Reed knowledge will be at the top of this iceberg. These are basic things you should know if you like Zach Reed. And then towards the bottom of the iceberg, we get a little deeper. Things that you wouldn't really know unless you really are into Zach Reed and you're a big fan of him. So without further ado, let's get into this shit. Okay, so I have notes here on the trap phone and I'm just going to run through them when I'm doing these. So if you see me looking down, that's why I'm looking down. Just so I make sure I don't forget anything, you know? So on tier one, the first entry we have on this iceberg is Teenage Brat. For those of you who are somehow unaware, you've uh, never heard it. This is the first album released by Zach St. John's called Teenage Brat. Came out in sometime, I think in September 2020, around that time. So if you haven't heard this I don't even know why you're watching this video. I'm just going to assume everyone who's watching this video has heard of or seen this album. The next one we have is Zach Selfie. This selfie is from May 17th, 2020, posted to Zach's Facebook. This image has been circulating around the internet. It's become a little bit of a meme among Zach Reed fans. So a lot of you probably recognize this one. Next up, we have Ethan and Zach chilling in the kitchen. Ethan and Zach are pretty good friends. If you know anything about Zach Reed, you would know that he is really good friends with Ethan. That's why this one's so high up. A lot of people know that. Next up on the entry list, we have Alaskan Border Patrol. Sometime in 2020, 2021, I'm not quite sure, Zach went on patrol around the Alaskan border in Edmonton or something. Anyway... We're gonna get into tier two. Okay, so tier two, we're still pretty high up. Most of you guys should know these, but if you don't, we're gonna look at it anyway. That's what this video is about. So the first entry we have on tier two is OG Zach profile picture. This is, in my opinion, the most well-known Zach Reed image. Uh, if you're a longer fan of Zach's, longer term fan, you definitely know this, but if you're a newer fan, you might not know it. But if you've known this guy for a while and you've been paying attention to the stuff he's been making and you're a fan of his, you should know this picture if you've been a long time fan. If you're a newer fan, maybe I can understand not knowing it, but any long time fan will for sure recognize this image right here. This is fucking gold. This is a classic image. Next up, we have Lunchmate Reviews. This is another thing you should know. But once again, it's kind of more so for the long-term fans, people who have been a fan of Zach for a couple of years at least. And uh, probably around 2014, maybe 2015, Zach uploaded a series of Lunchmate reviews to his YouTube channel. This is pretty good content. If you guys haven't seen those, they're still up. I'll leave, I'll leave a link in the description. Sorry, guys, I can't talk today. Then we have Newfie Onions. This is uh, around 2014, I want to say. The Newfie clan was in full swing. Everybody knew the Newfie clan. And uh, not a lot of people know. Zach Reed was actually a part of it. And he was Newfie Onions on Xbox. Then we have New Hairdo, my dudes. Sometime in 2015, Zach Reed uploaded this picture right here to Instagram with the caption, New Hairdo, my dudes. And that's it for Tier 2. Okay, Tier 3. We're starting to get a little deeper here. Uh, we have fisheye Zach. This is just a funny picture of Zach with a fisheye lens uh, or the iPhone camera zoomed out really far. There's not much else to say about it besides that, but it's a pretty funny picture. Then we have Mafia Child Zach. This is a, one of my favorite pictures of Zach for sure. This one's pretty old. Once again, if you're a long-term fan, you probably know about this, but it's not as popular as, say, original Facebook profile picture Zach. Then we have Wiener Pizza picture. If you don't know Wiener Pizza... There's no way you've known about Zach Reed and his uh, content, and there's no way you've been a fan of him for less than a couple of years. This is a pretty old one, but Wiener Pizza, if you guys don't know, that doesn't directly relate to this image, but Zach played in a band called Wiener Pizza with a couple of his friends. Yeah, and this image, in my interpretation anyway, I couldn't really find anything on the internet about it. That's a reference to that in a way. 
Anyway, then we have the falling apart Instagram story. Basically, Zach Reed uploaded a series of Instagram stories to Instagram, obviously. And it, it was just a weekend bender. And it's still there. You can go watch all of these videos in their entirety on his Instagram story. So go check that out for sure. And that's it for tier three. Okay, now we're in tier four. We're getting pretty deep here. I feel like you might not know a lot of these now. Like, I don't know a lot of these myself now. We're getting in there, okay? We have the memes cover picture. This is Zach Reed's first cover picture on Facebook. I actually do know about this one. This is one of my favorite Zach Reed things. Um, really classic, really funny. The comment sections on a lot of these old Facebook profile pictures are pretty good. You guys should go check them out. Um... Then we have Child Zach with the conservative flag. There's not much else really to say about it besides Zach brandishing a couple straps. You can see the conservative flag in the background like he's some kind of racist or something. I'm just kidding. Anyway, <laughs> then we have eight-year-old birthday party, Zach. Once again, there's not much to really say about this one. It's just a picture of Zach sitting next to his eighth birthday cake. He's pretty young in that picture, but it's a pretty classic picture nonetheless. Then we have 120 Frecker. Um, this picture was taken in 120 Frecker after Zach Reed moved out of that location. As you can see, it's looking pretty barren there. A lot of, uh, memorable Zach Reed moments have happened at 120 Frecker, for sure. And then we just have Zach chilling. Okay, getting into tier 5 here, we have Zach high with his bro in the whip. Yo, this dude is stoned than a motherfucker. <laughs> Then we have paint.net edit Zach. Uh, around 2015, there was a lot of paint.net edits going on. There's a few more that I feel like should have been on here. For example, the Limp Biscuit edit. But yeah, this one is a certified classic for sure. Then we have streaking Zach. His parents were actually out for groceries when uh, this picture was taken, allegedly. That's what I read online. It's pretty funny, pretty silly if you ask me. Then we have bowed pinhead video with Zach. The reason I say bowed pinhead video is because getting really deep here, there's an old video. Uh, I'll actually play the video in its entirety here. Hey, you wanna know who I am? No, who does that? Pinhead. Do <laughs> yourself. <laughs> but uh, basically, at the end of the video, uh, Zach's just sitting on the couch. And that's where that picture is taken from. It's pretty funny if you watch it in its entirety. And that's actually it for tier five. So we'll get into tier six here now. Okay, here we have Zach on Canada Day when he was 12. Once again, there's not much to say about this one, but it's a pretty funny image, pretty classic image. Then we have the baked Matthew Bridger parody. Uh, this is doesn't really relate to Zach that much, but uh, hopefully... I would like to see a Matthew Bridger iceberg soon. I'll make a video about that if I ever stumble across one on the internet. But uh, there's a really funny picture of a guy named Matthew Bridger. If you guys have ever heard of him, uh, I'm a fan of his personally. But um, there's just a really funny picture of him. And uh, he's high out of his trees, you know. He's off one. And he's just holding the camera super close to his face like this. And... Um, he just, the caption was just, I'm cooked. And I don't know if this is a parody of that, but I mean, it, that's what I've always interpreted it as. It's a pretty classic image. Here we have Skater Boy. Not much else to say, just a guy skating, brandishing his weapon. Then we have Watching Us from the Big Cameras. I hope I can find the audio clip somewhere. If I can find the audio clip in its entirety somewhere, uh, I will play it. But uh, if not, if you don't know about this, the, in my opinion, this should be higher. This is a pretty well-known Zach Reed uh, endeavor. Watching us from their big cameras. Watching us from their big cameras. Working for survival. Means of survival. Working for survival. Means of survival. Working for survival. Means of survival. But uh, anyway, and then for the last one, we have Skag, the All-City King. I'm, I'm going to leave it at that. I'm not trying to incriminate nobody. Although I've probably already done that. Anyway, that's it for Tier 6. We'll get into Tier 7 now, shortly. Okay, getting into the abyss, the last tier here, uh, we have a lot of things that you might not know. I personally just happen to know most of these. Um, I didn't know a lot of the things in the higher tiers, but I know most of the things in this final tier here in the abyss. Um, anyway, let's get into it. We have St. John's, Ethan and Zach, sex. This picture is taken from a band practice in uh, 2016, maybe 17, I want to say. 
and those guys are going at it. And uh, whoever took that picture had the good sense to cover up what those two boys were doing with the St. John's filter on Snapchat. Then we have Bunny Man Zach. Uh, Zach Reed has made some secret videos. I'm not going to link it anywhere because I'm a gatekeeper. I don't want you guys to know about it. But there's a couple music videos circulating around uh, involving Bunny Man Zach. I forget the actual name of it right now. It's pretty like underground. But yeah, if you look really hard, you might be able to find that stuff. Then we have Angela White Ain't No Joke. I don't want to explain this one because it's pretty graphic, but it's a pretty classic one. This is one of my favorite entries on this iceberg. Really, really underground. You have to be like a really dedicated fan to know this one. This one's really niche. To sum it up, Angela White Ain't No Joke. And that's true. I can't argue with that. Then we actually have Playboy Centerfold, Zach. This was actually supposed to be in the issue of a Playgirl, actually, sorry. Um, the Centerfold. It was supposed to be the Centerfold, but uh, Zach's girlfriend at the time wasn't having any of it, and she called him gay. And he had, he had to contact Playgirl and say, hey, you guys can't publish this. Everyone's going to think I'm gay. And he lost a big paycheck from that, but it is what it is. And then this last one here, I'm actually, I can't show this picture um, I'll show, like, the top half of it. Um, I'm actually gonna blur it out at the start of the video, too. But, um, I don't want to talk about that one. As I'm sure, if Zach were to stumble across this video, I'm sure he wouldn't want me posting this one. This is a pretty graphic image here. It's pretty upsetting. Anyway, uh, that's it for today, guys. That's the Zach Reed whole iceberg complete analysis. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. What the fuck is up, everybody? If you enjoyed today's video, be sure to smash that motherfucking like button. I worked really hard on this video today, guys. It took me a lot of effort. So if you guys would not mind to smash that like button, it would not be underappreciated. I'm thinking about doing a giveaway soon, so stay tuned for that. In the meantime, hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe, hit the like button, and stay tuned for more videos. Peace.